All right, YouTube. Um, <laughs> you know, some people have an anxiety of leaving home, and some people have an anxiety of, you know, just different anxieties. I have an anxiety of being home too much. So I start feeling panicked. I start feeling overly exhausted. I start feeling too tired. Whoa. shooting today. Try to look for a few friends that we're going to go shooting with me, you know. I called up a girlfriend, called up uh, my other friend that's a girl. Well, I got a few friends that are girls, but uh, I'm trying to get a hold of my, my one friend. Can't seem to get his phone number. He, he was been wanting to go shooting with me for a while now. Today I'm going to do a little bit more of a detailed shooting video because I'm the only one up here. There's a bunch of shells there. Somebody come up the road. So I might not be the other one up here for a minute or two. Here's the range. This is the pistol range. That's the rifle range down there. I use uh, pistol range as rifle range though. I shoot, uh, I shoot my rifle up here. So... You know, it's long enough. This, this one doesn't have the furthest scope, so this range does quite nicely. I've got my box of 550 value pack uh, federal rounds. That's what I have used for a long time now. Um, they get absolutely no jams with them. No anything. They just run really clean. Uh, today I will be shooting my pistol. I've got my 1936 Winchester up in there and my uh, Marlin right there. Looks like somebody's that uh, will be coming up here. So I will not be the only one up for, uh, for a little bit. So I'm going to go down and go grab some golf balls and, and I will be uh, back and I'll be shooting. Hopefully this is recording. Yep, anyways, so I'm done shooting now. I've been up there for like two and a half hours. I've done a few video clips here and there. Some of the fun, tricky things that I haven't tried yet. And I'm, I, honestly, I have to say I'm a pretty good shot. You know, the scope, of course, you're gonna hit something with the scope as long as you've got it scoped in right. Um, the iron sight rifle, the Winchester. Um, I can hit a lot of things with that. That thing's extremely accurate. Pistol is still hard to uh, to fire off and hit things with, but I can still hit things at uh, you know, close range, which pistols aren't made for long range anyways. So, um, so I'm going to be heading home here. Uh, the last video clip, if I'm going to put these all together, it'd be the last video clip. And if it's not going to be the last video clip, you know, I'm probably just going to 
post the very first of this video and the very last of the, this video here together and then just say right now that all the videos that I took up here will be posted over a week or two. That's what I'm going to do. Um, but I will post one on the very end of this. It's me hitting a nickel. It's me. I had a target at the very, very, very end of the shooting range as far as I could go out. And I set up a nickel at the very, very end and taped it up so it was just sitting there. It's kind of wiggling around. And I hit it set straight in the center, sent it through the target, and I don't know where it is. It uh, got lost in the hill somewhere because it's just loose dirt behind the hill. But I wish I could have kept that nickel and said, I hit this nickel. This is mine. You know, it's pretty cool. I'll, I'll have to try a nickel and a dime next time. See if I can hit the dime. But pretty cool. I'll have to bring up something like a piece of wood to put behind them so they don't go through the target and I lose them. But I do have proof. I have a video of it. So. Enjoy the video, and I'll uh, see you later. All the videos I took up here, I'll post uh, later in the week. Uh, later next week, and maybe even after that. What I like to do is I like to do small engine repair, then gun videos, then small engine repair, then gun video, and so on. So the guys that have subscribed to me for gun videos, they will uh, they'll enjoy the gun videos, but they won't get overflowed in small engine videos. But the guy, all the guys that are... Um, have subscribed to me for all my small engine videos, don't get overflowed in gun videos, but a lot of them like guns, gun videos anyways, so it's a kind of a win-win situation, so hope you li like uh, the video, I'll see you later YouTube, bye. Apologize for the wind. Ha <laughs> ha.